I like to sing. I wish I could sing like those guys who can sing two notes at once, those monks. It takes some ten years to learn how to do it, but it's worth it, because God really sits up and notices when you sing chords. And there were all those monks that used to copy the Bibles and this very neat lettering, and let me tell you, when you write all neat and pretty like those monks did, you can bet that God sits up and takes notice. Those monks receive divine grace, or my name isn't whatever my name is. I wonder if I can make a monk laugh. I wonder if I can make a monk spit out his chocolate milk through his nose. I wonder if I can make a monk accidentally break a vow of silence. I wonder if I have the heart to even attempt such a thing. It seems so cruel. Those monks are silent for a reason, a beautiful reason. And you can bet that when one of those monks doesn't speak for, say, a year or two, you can bet that God sits up and takes notice. God appreciates shit like that. Of course, you might figure that with all the records I've made that God would have noticed me too, but I would think that if there was a God, God would notice everything. Hell, God probably would be everything. If, on the other hand, there is no God, if there's only space aliens, for example, that would be a different story. I mean, I'm sure space aliens would notice the monks that sing the two notes at once, and even the monks that take vows of silence. But would a space alien be able to tell the difference between a beautiful handwritten Bible and one made with state-of-the-art desktop publishing software? See, that's where the real story is. In the competition for the attention of the space aliens. So everyone's equal in the eyes of God, but the space aliens, you gotta figure they would play favorites. 